I've no idea what EA are doing at this point. I literally have zero idea, but what EA have done is they have actually... So, actually, it's not EA to be fair. So what's happened is FIFA 20 is actually available to some people right now. Some people have FIFA 20 right now, which is ridiculous. Apparently, uh, so EA send their games out early. And apparently some stores in Spain have been selling FIFA 20 this early, like three weeks early before the release, which is ridiculous. So there is some leaked ratings. I'm going to show you guys some cards. None of the official gameplay or anything like that will be in this video. We'll just see uh, cards that have been created uh, via websites. They're not actually the official cards, so they won't have the official photos. But uh, supposedly, all the stats and ratings are completely official. And I've seen screenshots from official the official game, basically, uh, proving that these are legit. Now, EA can and probably will change a few ratings here and there. Um, they've always withheld the ability to change ratings all the way up to literally the day before the game comes out. Um, so if that happens, then there may be a couple of players that have lower ratings, higher ratings, different stats that here and there. Um, they may in fact do that, but pretty much all of these should be completely official and real and legit. So let's actually go into them. Before we do that, just want to quickly say I'm really, really close to 100,000 subscribers. So if you guys could subscribe, it would mean the absolute world to me. I'd be really grateful. It's my all-time goal on YouTube. I'd be very grateful if you guys could subscribe. Let's get into all the ratings now. We'll start off with David De Gea, who's had a minus two downgrade. Uh, unfortunately, he did make a lot of, uh, you know, poor stuff last year basically for my night he was he wasn't amazing unfortunately and for spain in the world cup so uh he's had a minus two downgrade disappointingly enough frankie de Jong has had an 85 rated card at buyer uh buyer at barcelona um nice looking card as well uh very nice 82 base 88 dribbling 85 passing looks like a very usable card james rodriguez with the 85 rated card at real madrid now uh, obviously, his load at Bayern has uh, finished. I don't know if there's any more drama with the transfer window coming up soon. Maybe he moves to a different club. I don't know. I don't know if the transfer window is still open, actually. Again, like, I've, I've been so out of it. I've actually got... I'm full of a cold right now, so I've just been out of it. But 85 rate card, apart from his pace being obliterated, it's actually a really, really nice card. Then we have Lenglet, who looks like a really usable centre-back now, which is amazing. So you can get the perfect link to him. Titsy now, uh, he looks like a really good usable centre-back, and I'm really excited about that. It looks really solid. Next up is Marcus Rashford, 83 rated left wing card now. So he's actually had an upgrade from last year, and that card looks really, really good. You'll see Martial's rating in this video, and I think that Martial and, and Rashford could be the new Mbappe and Neymar partnership up top. They look really, really good. Uh, without further ado, though, let's move into the next one. We're getting one of the big boys out of the way really, really early. It is Cristiano Ronaldo. Now, I don't have his official in-game stats. However, 93 rated this year. So interesting uh like i said don't have his official stats there's a few people in this video that i don't have the official stats for i've just seen the screenshots of their ratings uh this is one of them obviously he'll have a different badge in fever 20 it'll be a piemonte calcio badge um but i put juve for now because he actually just played for juve uh but yeah cristiano ronaldo does in fact have a 93 rated card. 82 rated for Inaki Williams. 80 rated card for Jao Felix could be a really good starter card. Apparently will have five star skills as well, which is pretty exciting. So could be a really good uh, card for starter teams. 79 rated St. Maximin for Newcastle. 82 rated downgraded Kimpembe now as well. Uh, still looks like a really solid card for starter teams. 83 rated Drissa Gay. Really, really nice looking card as well. Bernardo Silva with a saucy upgrade. Centre mid as well. Looks actually really 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 good looks incredible will be a fantastic cam for most teams this year looks really really nice and really excited to use him neymar's withheld his 92 rated card as well which is pretty interesting uh, i know he's not had a lot of game time recently and uh, there's been some hostility here and there possibly could be moving to a different club but he's withheld his 92 rating regardless and probably five star skills on weak foot 91 rate eden hazard withheld his rating uh, a few stats here and there are different from last year but yeah pretty much the same rating and stuff like that manlas with the 85 rated card marquinhos with the 86 rated card i'll be interested to see what his in-game stats look like looks like a solid card though uh being obviously getting upgrades so i'm excited to see that downgraded 85 rated alexandro pretty interesting let me know what you think down below downgraded 84 rated arturo vidal Sami handanovic withholds his 88 rating paul pogba also withholds his 88 rating this one's pretty interesting i was actually i was expecting a downgrade for pogba but um but he's withheld his rating uh we'll be interested to see what he does this season and if he withholds his rating for uh, the january upgrade as well ericsson with the 88 raid as well withholds his rating from last year will be a really solid cam as always luis suarez with a downgrade to 89 rated i've heard he's they they've also butchered his pace 
which uh, is ridiculous and hopefully not true, but that's what I've heard. Uh, regardless, I think that uh, a downgrade, I mean, I don't really watch the league, so I wouldn't know, um, but it'll probably still be pretty usable, not going to lie. Hugo Lloris withholds his rating. Benzema with an 87 rated upgrade card uh, looks really nice, although the stats definitely don't look an 87 rated card. Gareth Bale with a big downgrade and a big dribbling downgrade as well. Still looks like he'd probably be really solid in game, but uh, yeah, 85 rated Bale. Here's the controversy. Apparently, Leo Messi is 94 rated and Ronaldo is 93 rated. That is pretty interesting, uh, given that obviously Ronaldo is lower rated in FIFA 20 than Leonardo Messi. Pretty interesting. I don't know. Let me know what you think down below. He's a 92 rated upgrade of passing. Uh, a really, really nice card. And he's back to right wing too. Pretty interesting there. So uh, let me know what you think down below. A ridiculous. Ridiculous Anthony Martial 85 rated upgrade, upgrade striker card as well. Now you know why I was saying, you know, Rashford and Martial together could be a force to be reckoned with. Could be the new Neymar and Mbappe link there. Uh, ridiculous looking card. Looks incredible. Cannot wait to use it. The name with a big upgrade from a silver to a gold. Carrot with a minor upgrade. Upper main card with a downgrade, actually. Uh, although the only thing that got, down, got downgraded in his card was pace. And his defending actually got upgraded. So a bit of a weird downgrade. Konate with a huge upgrade. That perfect link between Upper Mencano and uh, Konate could be actually really, really cool. Di Maria with an upgrade too. Mo Salah with a really, really nice 90 rated card. Looks like he'll be probably one of the best right wings on the game next year from the Premier League. Looks absolutely incredible. Really excited to try that card out as well. Looks really, really nice. 90 rated Virgil van Dijk also looks absolutely incredible. Cannot wait to try this card out. I bet he'll be as incredible as he was last year too. Interesting. 85 rated Robertson, also another interesting one. Looks like it'd be an incredible, incredible card. 88 rated Raheem Sterling, also a really, really nice looking card. I bet he'll be pretty good to use. Probably like a cheaper Salah kind of card. And an 81 rated Ndombele. Looks like a really nice looking card. Would be great to use that in a starter team. Now, there are a few Twitter accounts I would check out if I were you. I've been perusing my Twitter timeline, seeing about a lot of different leaks, also seeing a bunch of photos of dogs. Um, so FIFA 20 News seems to have a lot of leaks. Uh, they seem to have the full no May United squad here. Uh, 89 De Gea, 77 Romero, 71 Grant, 81 wan 84 uh, Maguire, 82 Short, 81 Lindelof, 80 Bailly, 79 Young, 77 Jones, Pogba, 88, Matic, 83 and so on and so forth. Apparently, this is the uh, May United squad. That's what he said apparently it is. Uh, also, Sander is a really, really good uh, source to look at. He's been tweeting out a load of photos of uh, official um, uh, cards. Uh, stats not official for Mares, but official cards here and there. Um, so you guys can go check out all the cards that Sander has posted. Uh, Foot Donk is another one that has been posting a bunch of uh, leaks and, and ratings and stuff like that. You can go and check out. Uh, he is another one. And obviously there are photos from uh, from different things you can go check out here and there and everywhere, basically. And last but not least, Foot Spy at Foot Spy is also a great one to check out. So go check out all those accounts if you guys want to check out for yourself some different leaks, screenshots all that sort of stuff make sure you guys go and check those out uh thank you all for watching this video um like i said some of these are official some of these aren't it just is what it is it is how it is um so we'll see how it is for fifa 20 we'll see the ratings i imagine ea will release a database pretty soon as it's all been leaked anyway uh pretty interesting and weird how ea have done it they've not released official icons yet although there are some that are official uh, or non-official that have been leaked so apparently this is all the fifa 20 icons we've got dalgleish barnes or not all of them but then all the new ones so we've got dalgleish barnes sanchez rush kaka zambrotta essien garincha and guardiola those are the ones that haven't been uh, publicly announced yet apparently um which is pretty interesting and uh you know we're obviously looking forward to seeing that uh and that will probably get announced pretty soon too so uh that is apparently it for all the rates well it's not it but that's apparently well it's the ones i've seen so far so i just want to make a video to show you guys all the apparently leaked ratings uh i actually believe it i do believe all of them i believe every single one of them i think they're all legit um so if that's anything to go off that's what i take away from that thank you all for watching thank you all for watching liking and subscribing um I really appreciate everything you guys have done for me over the last year. And uh, hopefully we can keep moving forward, keep climbing to 100,000 subs. Go check out G Fuel, link in the description. Where is it? There it is. Uh, use code Haber to get uh, yourself a discount on G Fuel. Uh, and yeah, go check out those Twitter accounts for more leaks. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you later.